Hi, my name is Nate. I'm with Advantage Label and Packaging, and this is the Epson C7500G. Today, we're going to be going over how to adjust the print placement on your printer. As you begin sending print jobs to the Epson, you may notice that the artwork isn't lining up perfectly with the label. You might see a white line on one edge, or you might notice that there's a little bit of ink on the liner that isn't drying. This ink will never dry and can make a big mess, especially if you're hand applying. So let's fix the issue. Before you print another job, you should see this window. We're going to click on Properties. This will bring up your driver settings window. At this point, I'm assuming that you have your label format set up correctly and that we only need to make minor adjustments to the print placement. If this is not the case, shoot me an email and I'd be more than happy to help get you up to speed here. Next, we're going to click on Printer Utilities and then we're going to choose the third option down, which is Printer Settings Utility. This utility is actually changing settings on the printer itself and it usually takes a minute for this window to boot up. Once it does, we have the option to make changes to the horizontal print start position, the vertical print start position, and the cut position. In this case, we're going to be making changes to the vertical print start position. As you can see, the adjustment increments are in tenths of a millimeter, so if you only click on it once or twice, you're probably not going to notice any sort of change. In this case, I'm starting with a full millimeter and a half of adjustment. So we'll make that change, send the job to the printer, and see what kind of change our adjustments have made. All right, this is a little bit closer than the last time, but you can still see a little bit of a white line at the bottom now. So it looks like we've overcorrected. So what I'm gonna do is open up the settings again, back off on the adjustments by a little bit, send another job to the printer, and see how these changes look. Bada bing, bada boom. If you need additional support here, or if you have any other questions about the Epson or label printing in general, I'd be more than happy to help you out. Shoot me an email at nk@advantagelabel.com.